Uh, it's December 24th, 2012, and this is my Christmas gift. A new motor for 3231 Charlie E35 Bonanza. So I've been telling everyone about this job that's been taking about uh, two months. And so I wanted to show everything that's been done to the airplane. So the first thing we'll notice is a new overhauled motor. This is from a friend of mine at Beach Talk. This motor was going into a restoration project that was abandoned. Interestingly enough, the airframe now belongs to the Shannon Aviation. They're doing some research with it, and I got the motor. Guess I'm driving mine. There's nobody up there. All right. We'll see ya. Merry Christmas, Billy. That's my mechanic. Put all this together. He's doing a fantastic job. I took the air oil separator home and painted it to match the ignition harness. And I also spent a lot of time in here polishing the firewall, trying to get some of the original 1954 paint off. I didn't spend too much time on it. Billy installed a remote oil filter. It's by Airwolf. That'll make oil changes real easy. It's got all new uh, overhauled accessories. It's hard to see the accessories on this airplane, but they're all back there and they're newly overhauled. It's got a newly overhauled exhaust. It's got um, the original carburetor actually from my airplane because the carburetor was working pretty good. So we didn't want to mess up too much. A lot of work on the elbow down here to get it working correctly. And on the other side you can see a temperature probe. So I've now got the inlet temperature for the, for the motor. New baffles on the front, sealed up real good. It's got a newly overhauled prop, which looks really sharp. And the spinner looks awful. That'll be taken care of in paint here in a couple months, but underneath that, the hub just looks immaculate. Here you can see more of the new motor. Came with a uh, Came with this oil cooler, oil tank, which is a little bit nicer than mine, so this one got installed. One of the things you may notice is all the wiring for the Insight G2 engine monitor. <clears throat> You've got uh, exhaust probes right here on all the exhaust manifolds. And then underneath you can also see it's got uh, temperature probes for the cylinder head. Also on each cylinder it's got new engine heater band on each one of the cylinders and then it also has a uh, preheat for the oil tank right back here so I'll plug this in in the hangar and it'll heat up the engine and it'll heat up the oil tank before I get to the airplane and in the hangar I've got a uh, switch box I bought from a friend at Beach Talk and that will allow me to start preheating the motor with my cell phone just send it a place a call to the heater and it'll fire right up the engine will fire up but the heater will <laughs> you see uh, it's hard to tell in the hangar here all the new accessories back there up in the front here you can see the uh, newly overhauled pitch change motor the prop just cycles silky smooth now this is an electric prop I may do a video later on showing how the prop works and there you can kind of see the new ring gear everything looks real nice I hate to pan out too much because now the airplane doesn't match the motor <laughs> the airplane needs some paint it's looking awful but we're getting there we're getting there it'll look just as good as uh, some of the other airplanes in here maybe <laughs> I also installed some uh, LED nav lights here. They look real nice, real bright. It really cleans it up. And um, got some new uh, landing lights on the way that Santa's bringing me tomorrow. And then uh, hopefully in March we're looking at a new paint job. As you can see from here, the paint looks real nice. <laughs> but not so much up close. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye. Merry Christmas.